Hey, it's Joey here again. Um, this time we're going to go with, we're doing Infinity Wings, Scout, and Grunt. I'm going to reposition that just a bit. So, yeah, this time I am going with my Mayflash Arcade Stick here. Really, I think all arcade shooters, or all space shooters rather, should be played with an arcade stick. But anyway, let's get to the game. So this is Infinity Wings, Scout, and Grunt. And... Okay, I had this working previously, and, um... Okay. I don't know. There we go. I'm going to choose that one. That third one is not available yet. That's coming soon, I guess. I don't know if I have to beat a certain point or um, wait for an update on the game. But, oh man, I just realized my... Okay, no, we're good. <laughs> I thought my webcam was a bit mispositioned, but I think we're good. Okay, there we go. So honestly, I have not made it out of this first level on this game yet. Played it one time the other night, so... We'll see how this goes. I came close to making it out of the first level the other night, but... The boss that I was facing, and this changes the boss each time you play it. <laughs> um, the boss that I was playing, uh, facing, it was... Um, I'd finally figured out how to beat him, and... Well, he killed me anyway. thing about it, these regular bullets, you have unlimited bullets, but if you hold it down too long, they stop firing after a bit, so you do want to be careful about that. This first level is mainly just asteroids and a boss. I do believe there's other enemies in the game. <laughs> if there's not, then it's kind of boring. And I can't use my bullets for the moment because I held it down too long. There we go. Yeah, I just now noticed there's kind of a meter that lets you know when <laughs> you're about to not be able to use those bullets anymore. So good to pay attention to that. It's uh, in the bottom right hand corner. <laughs> it on the bullets for the moment. <clears throat> We're not far from the boss now. There's a little, um, there's a counter at the top right that indicates how far you are from the boss.
Okay, here we go, guys. This is the boss. The music changes and it becomes scary. Okay. I have not faced this one yet. Okay, oh gosh, what the heck? Oh man, oh. Yikes! He just disintegrated me. I don't know what he's continuing to shoot at, but yeah, I just got disintegrated, guys. Let's try that again. Oh, oh, I did not mean to exit out the, oh, there. Sorry, guys. Let me load it back up. <laughs> So we're going to load the game back up. Make sure... Okay, good. It's showing up in OBS. So, accidental game quidditch there. But we're back on. Okay, you know, I have not tried this other one, the grunt, I have not tried grunt, I've been using scout the whole time, maybe grunt will yield me better results, we'll see. Alright, take off. Okay, I think I like Grunt a little more so far. Yeah. Yeah, I'm totally feeling this one more. Now this one, his bullets he can run out of, but are the regular bullets like that? It does look like he can run out of that. Um, but this one, he doesn't. So this attack will stop working just like the other, <laughs> eventually. If you hold it down so long like I was doing. But I think overall, I like this one more. Oh gosh, that was close, man. Graphics in here are interesting. It is a 2D game, but the sprites and stuff are kind of 3D. Then, of course, we had a 3D scene at the beginning when we took off.
close to the boss now. All right. Enemy battle now. And the music changes. Okay, yeah, this is the one I tried to defeat before. Set. I can't seem to do it with. I can't do it with grunt. I can only do it with scout. Oh man. I think this is why people don't like the unpredictable games. Now, the downside to this and Stearden, uh, the, uh, this particular game, the level doesn't change until the very end. You just have a bunch of asteroids. And in Stearden, at least everything else changes. I mean, this, your boss changes every time, which makes it really crazy. I think I'd prefer everything to change, really. <laughs> But, you know, what can you say? Not really that much into this game. I like Stearden a lot more. But let's give this another try. With a uh, scout, you could go right up to that guy's guns and um, just use that little um, bomb thing that he has and blow them up. With grunt, you can't seem to do that. Gotta be careful on my guns here. Fifty five seconds away from the enemy. Five seconds away. I 
right, let's see what will happen now. Destroy him? That was a little too easy. What the heck? That just seemed too easy, guys. Oh, we just have more asteroids? Is it just asteroids and then you um, have an enemy? Oh, gosh. I really don't like that. I want actual enemies in this. I mean, yeah, you could play the... You could kill the asteroids for score, I guess, but... I really don't pose much of a challenge. I want them to actually have some kind of attack or something. Have some kind of AI. Oh, okay, that's an interesting one. So all you're doing in this game is going through here, destroying asteroids, and then finding an enemy. <laughs> it's really, to me, not that impressive. So I think after I die this time, I'm going to end this, because <laughs> I'm just not that impressed with this game. Uh, this is a waste of my graphics card power here, I think. Hey, it's time for the enemy. That's kind of boring. I don't like shooting. Okay. I think this one I'm going to try for... Okay, it seems like that one... What the... Oh, that's right. That thing explodes. <laughs> I forgot. Yeah, um, uh, yeah, I'm just not that crazy about this game, even using the arcade stick, it's just, I don't know, going around shooting asteroids, um, Infinity Wings EXE has stopped working, of course it has, I just closed it, 
<laughs> yeah, um, yeah, that game, you know, just, um, go around, shoot asteroids, and then there's a boss at the end of the level. Um, I, not crazy about that. It just seems like that was just a lazy programming thing, um, or lazy design decision, decision rather, um, I'm not sure. Uh, it's just not my favorite game. Actually, I don't know, I'd have to say that's my least favorite space shooter ever. <laughs> okay, we're back to game day Saturday, and this is Gun Wings. Um, this is a really interesting game. It kind of reminds me of Raiden a bit, but you've got a lot of Japanese characters.